just skedaddled back from the mailbox because I saw that my Target Beauty Box had come. I just took the plastic off while I was getting my camera set up, but it is $5. I believe this one has sold out. I think, though, that they usually release them every season, so my biggest suggestion to you guys, and I know I said this in my other Target videos, which of course I will link below, is to follow the uh, Nouveau Cheap on Instagram. She always posts when these become available, and I think that's the fastest way to find out. I do follow Target Style on Facebook, and I try to check the website, but I've always ended up finding out about it through the Nouveau Cheap's Instagram. So, and she's got great deals otherwise too. So she's just a really awesome person to follow and she's got a great blog. But anyway, this one was $5. It included shipping and it also, with the red card, was um, just like your standard Target product. So you get the 5% off that you would with your red card. So I have not opened it, but this is the box. It's a sturdy box. It just came wrapped in some plastic with my address on it. And then you open it up, and usually there's a coupon, and it tells you what's in here. It says, hello, beautiful. And it does have a $3 off, $15 or more, so that is just so awesome. And it comes with one, two, three, four, five products. And then it also comes with 20% off at dermstore.com, which I believe has also come in my other boxes. All right, something in mine must have leaked a little bit. Oh, it's this. Ooh, that's a huge bummer. Although... I think we're all going to survive. It smells pretty good. It just wasn't screwed on. This is the Superfruit Complex 10-in-1 Renewal System Marula Oil and Biotin Shampoo. As you can see, it's kind of goobery. Um, and it says, it's sulfate-free, antioxidant-rich shampoo. Helps to renew vibrancy for dull, lackluster hair. So that seems nice. If it hadn't leaked all over the place, it doesn't seem to have damaged anything. So that's good. And then, oh, this is so cool. I really wanted to try this. This is the Infallible Pro Spray and Set Makeup Extender Setting Spray. Um, and I think it was Glam Life Guru? No. What is her name? I will link this video below if I can remember what it was. I had seen someone on YouTube use something like this as a quick primer before their foundation and then use it as a setting spray as well. I'm not sure it wasn't this. I'm not sure if this would work, but I think that would be awesome, especially when you are in a makeup hurry. And I've heard really good things about this. It's a really nice size. It's 3.4 fluid ounces. And I believe this itself is 13, 14 bucks. So that's really neat. And then as I mentioned, I knew this was in there. This is the Tree 2 Extra Hold Extra Firm Control Hairspray. This is a travel size. I have a big one that I used on my daughter when she was in dance and we're still going through it because she's not in dance anymore and I really never use hairspray but it's really nice fine mist it does leave your hair decently touchable but it has a really nice hold and a decent smell so if you're looking for a good hairspray I highly recommend that one as hairsprays go and then there's a tiny Neutrogena Hydra Boost gel cream for extra dry skin which is me it says it has hyaluronic acid in it. This is really tiny though. Let's see. It says a non-greasy skin quencher instantly absorbs like a gel but intensely moisturizes like a cream. And so yeah, it looks like it's a nice moisturizer. It does not have SPF in it, I don't think. So tiny, you guys. And let's see that. Okay. Very cool. There was nothing about the setting spray that I didn't share with you guys. Ooh, and this is super goobery. Um, let's see. This is the Maybelline Color Elixir in Rose Redefined. Let me look and see if I Okay, have this I did color. look in my makeup stash, and this is not a color that I have, so I am going to open it and swatch it for you guys on my lips. I love these. I have a video on these with lip swatches of the colors that I do have, and I will link that below as well, but let's just do a quick try on, shall we? And here's this one on the lips, and there's the swatch. I will link the video that I have on the Maybelline Color Elixirs below. I love these. If you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, hang out with me for a while, and let me know what you got in the box, especially if your colors varied, because I think the products don't vary, but I think that sometimes the colors do. And yeah, hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Thanks for watching.